Cascade Sports. I'm here, and we just finished watching the Park Hill um, versus Pleasant Hill game. Right now, I have the head coach of Park Hill, Coach David Garrison. How's it going? Good, how are you doing? Good, good. Coach, tell us a little bit about yourself and how long you've been coaching. Uh, this is my seventh year at Park Hill High School. Uh, this is my tenth year as a head coach. Uh, before my head coaching experience, I had five years as an assistant coach at Chilla Coffee. So, 15 years total in the game. Okay, Coach, you guys came off with the victory. Tell us how you feel about that. You know, the, the first half, I, I thought maybe we were a little jitterish with how we came out, and yeah, we had a nice little game. Uh, once we came out at halftime, one of the things that we talked about was you know, we knew it wasn't going to get a great effort. They were going to keep fighting regardless of the situation in the game. They had a quick run, got to make it a basketball game. We tightened up just a little bit, but as we went throughout the game, we had some crazy things happen, but we hit some free throws and got some stops down the stretch. Like this. Pretty, pretty solid play. Um, There's a lot of good teams in this tournament. Is there any schools that you're looking forward to competing against? Now, the, the great thing about this tournament is when you get in the bracket, you're going to get to play somebody that you don't normally play, and then there's always going to be great teams, regardless of how the seeds fall out. You have 24 teams from Kansas City playing. You know, our bracket is loaded. You know, Pleasant Hill was, was a great team. They did a great effort. Above us with Grady and Smith, they were two real good teams. You know, the top of the track, and then obviously Liberty is the number one seed. So it's a great tournament. We're glad to be a part of it. Coach, de describe the type of play that the Park Hill Trojans displayed today. You know, I, I think the one thing that, that we did is we just kept out of adversity. You know, we had some things happen where, uh, you know, we had some breakdowns, but we didn't let it affect us and cost us a basketball. You know, and, and that's just kind of one of the maturity things that we need to do. And if things don't go our way, we need to be able to fight through that. I thought we did that. You know, we got the victory, which was the number one goal that we had. Are there things we need to do better? Certainly there is. But, uh, you know, we're glad to What goals uh, are your team looking forward to um, obtaining this year? You know, we, we sat down as a team, and this year we had our, our team set goals that we wanted to have. And, you know, the thing that we they set down, the, the five items were 100% effort. We wanted to have good team chemistry. We wanted to stay positive. We wanted to have uh, be productive role models. Uh, and then we wanted to uh, have zero on-court issues uh, this season. You know, those are goals that we have. We have some destinations that are kind of personal for our team, but you know, we feel if we do those five things throughout the, a game and a season, you know, we'll be successful. Okay, Coach, would you give us a um, couple of strengths and weaknesses that you noticed on your team this year? You know, right now, uh, I think that we, have, we have quite a few kids who are capable of being scorers. We have some kids that are, are good shooters. We just have to make sure that we have confidence as we go out and do that. Uh, you know, right now, defensively, we have a lot of work to do. Uh, we have to be, do better at uh, uh, just guarding the basketball and not letting the basketball by us. And that's just a one-two thing and an attitude thing that we have to develop. You know, we don't have any, we have some length uh, at our positions. We don't have any real, real big guys with some size. Uh, so we have to make sure that as a team, we play good team defense. Okay, Coach, once again, congratulations on the win. You have any shout-outs? No, thank you guys for coming out here. All right, well, we look forward to covering you all the rest of the season and wish your team the best of luck. You heard it first from Coach Garrison, Park Hill Trojans. I'm Marlo Garlington. This is Cascade Sports. What's up, Kansas City? I'm Brianna Garlington. I'm Charles Williams. And I'm Derek Parker. And we are CMG. CMG. And we would like to welcome you to follow both websites. That's whatsupkansascity.net and CascadeSports.tv. Some of our programs consist of Are You Awoke, Coach's Corner, and many more interviews, news, and blogs. Be sure to like our Facebook page and follow us on Instagram at Cascade Media Group and Twitter at What's Up KC and Cascade Sports. And remember, the victory cost success goes to the best prepared. And when you invest in your community, you are really just investing in yourself. So don't just like it, share it.